I'm 57 years old and literally my first time voting ever in my life for anything. For Eric, the vote matters, and he's confident his has some value in an election he feels strongly about. I'm at the Natrona County Courthouse where people are lining up before the election to make sure their voices are heard. Among discussion of the weight of individual votes and the possibility of voter fraud, people in Casper express some certainty in the veracity of their county's votes. I'm very hopeful. You know, America needs to be brought back. I'm grateful for the opportunity, you know, to be able to... My grandmother Louise used to say, stand up and be counting. We asked Natrona County Clerk Tracy Good about the safety and integrity of our votes. She let us in on a small portion of the process of transporting results. There's a USB stick with all the results on it, which they are secured. They are brought to my office by either a uniformed sheriff deputy or a designated election staff. Then they are downloaded into our hardened, secured computer for those um, totals. Tracy also told us that no ballot is counted without valid ID and registration. Provisional votes are never opened unless the voter can provide valid documents the day after the vote is sealed. Speaking for Natrona County, I'm very um, confident in the security and the accuracy of this election. Election day is November 5th, and for voters who cannot make it on election day, early and absentee voting will still be available until then. Duncan Cowan, your Wyoming Link, Casper.